but I wanted to see, you know, how well does Rosemary really work on its own. If I use it consistently for three months, what change would I see? Would I lose hair, would I grow hair, or would it stay the same? Like those are what I really wanted to know outside of all the derma rolling, outside of the other oils, the coffee, all the stuff that I was using. I needed to just see rosemary alone by itself. So for three months, I used rosemary specifically by itself. And basically my hair stayed the same. I didn't need to derma roll. I didn't need to do any of the extras. I do scalp massages as well. I still do my scalp massages. And of course, I do not use rosemary oil by itself. It is something that needs to be used in a carrier oil. My favorite carrier oil is pumpkin seed oil. I have an entirely new oil blend that I've been using, and I will post a video about that eventually. I apply this oil mixture probably about three times a week. I don't use a lot of oil on my hair like I used to. It's only when my hair starts to get any type of length to it that I might use oil more and more on a regular basis. And for those of you who wanted to look at my hair, like this... This is my hair today. As you can see, like it's still a little thin right here. This area has always been thin right there. I'm still slowly, slowly regrowing this temple right here. And this temple has just come back strong. Like there's less than half an inch between this temple and my eyebrow. This one is, yeah, it's still got some ways to go. Like I wish it would just go ahead and kind of just push forward this way and, and kind of merge. Even my hairline, you know, kind of goes like this and then it arches up this way. So I'm still trying to recover small bits of my hairline along here. So after using rosemary oil consistently for three months, about three times a week, sometimes four, these are the results.